issues on climate change. That's the biggest threat to the Pacific Islands because of uh, sea level rise. It is a threat also to their livelihoods as far as fisheries is concerned. You can't change climate change impacts, but you can manage and you can adopt. Leadership is going to play an important role in addressing those issues. The Pacific Fisheries Leadership Program, it does a whole suite of training for folks. So it's training in kind of that basic management and then looking at adaptive leadership. The FLB uh, helps build my, my confidence as a Samoan woman to be able to lead. I, I was able to identify and understanding my values as well as managing um, the people and managing the change within our team. I'm thankful that I'm one of those who went through this. Eh? It has made me become aware of myself, who am I and what type of a person I am and what I can be if I try that. Eh? With the COVID-19 pandemic, I felt that my leadership role in fisheries was really put to test. With the help of some problem-solving tools that uh, we learned during, as part of our PFLP training, then we came out with you know, some solutions. A couple of things I've learned from this leadership program. I've always thought that leadership is around you know, maintaining peace and harmony and all this, but that's not true. Leadership is also about bringing up issues. And then it makes me think quickly on how, how do I approach this issue? It gives me that broad picture and confidence to be able to address issues. And then we offer them these coaching sessions. So when they finish the week of learning, the journey does not end. They continue to engage with coaches, try to get them to explore not just what they have learned during the course, but different aspects of how they can continue to improve. Uh, should we face you know, challenges, we can always come back to our trainers to give us more guidance, to empower us to effectively carry out our, our work. Quite a significant portion of the participants have been women in the program, which has been fantastic. That's what you're hearing from heads of fisheries departments, is that they want more women. Fisheries is a, it's mainly male-oriented career. It is very important for a woman to um, have the leadership uh, role. We're looking at um, an increasing complexity from impacts to climate change or the natural environment. It's going to be really important that countries are able to work together, um, which means there's going to have to be just a high level of engagement and a lot of leadership on the part of Pacific Island countries. The Pacific is not the same anymore. Today, we have issues that are even global in nature, regional in nature. And we need to step up, we need to build up our leaders' skills so that we can sit with those people from you know, global leaders, sit on the table across with them and face them and talk and bring up our issues.